People say often, how could a loving God send people to hell? He doesn't. You were already headed there. A loving God rescues people who ask to be rescued. A loving God says, there's one that wants my help. Everybody else doesn't want my help. They don't ask for it. They're in another family. They're team dragon. And the enemy convinces them that their good will outweigh their bad. And at the end, that I just choose who was better and the murderer down the street or that they saw on the news or the child abuser or all those things, right? Uh, Those are the people that hell is for. Hell was actually not for people at all. Hell was created, according to scripture, for the devil and one third angels that left heaven. It was created for other spiritual beings that didn't do what they were supposed to do. It wasn't created for humans. Humans were created to live and coexist with God in a relationship, in a family. And the enemy is really good at what he does. And so God is not loving in in the sense that he's not loving in the sense that he sends people to hell. You are already headed to hell if you are born a sinner, sweetheart. That's what we have to comprehend is that he came to rescue. He came to redeem. 